Ooh, hello. But yes, welcome, welcome. Hope everyone's doing well. Uh, we're doing more Pokemans today. Can't remember what we were doing. Uh, we were supposed to do something. Also, we have a lot of uh, unreported tasks. We should do that. So thank you for redeeming first. Uh, Dalios. Give me a sec. Let's see. Attempt to do that. If I can type, I can't type. I hope you're doing well. Welcome in. Hope they haven't been too busy. Also, we got to get you some clips. But yeah, just some Pokemons. Nice and chill. I'm so shy still. It's still a baby shrew, but nah. Nah, you, you're fully experienced. You got this. To be fair, like, if there's one thing I recommend when you're starting out is uh, do your own clips, because e even at the best times, people, people, like, chatters and viewers won't do it. Can't expect them to do it for you. Um, if you type, like, I think it's slash marker, it also puts in a marker, so if you have a good moment, you can do that too. And you can go back and clip it after the fact. So I'm still gonna get. One day the stars are gonna align and I'm gonna turn up on your streams. You know this, right? Because at the moment, I think. I'm not sure what the time is on your side of the world, but it's like 3 o'clock in the morning for me. But one day, one day I'm gonna do it. One day I'll get up early enough. Uh, GMT zero. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so. Yeah, that makes sense. Ooh, I think. I think our time zones are way too different. Honestly, I so I'm in New Zealand. I am in the worst time zone for hanging out with anyone overseas. I hate it. I really fucking hate it. But I still have this plan to, to open up the Taco Bell. That's happening. But yeah, don't be afraid to make your own clips. I mean, I did. It's how you, it's how you get yourself out there. You know, you can upload them on the Tic Tacs and the, and the, and the face tubes. Yeah. I'm with the youth. I know what I'm talking about, right? Also, I'm supposed to go talking to this, this dude, aren't I? Hey, buddy, how you doing? Ooh, ooh, right, right. I should introduce you to the uh, entire team now we've got going. So, uh, what we got here? We got uh, our starter Pokemon. Do it. We got you yourself, Dalios. We got Lucio, who, uh, if anyone would like to name a Pokemon, we have two openings. We got Matt. We got Yowie Hands. And a Ponyta, if someone else would like to name it. Or take up the mantle of the name. But yes, we need to uh, report this data too. Better do that. Not Yowie Hands. Yes, Yowie Hands. Speaking of Yowie Hands, can't wait. It's Wednesday. It's going to be great. I don't know how I'm going to approach this. But it's going to be strange. Also, it seems you've made some new observations. Let's look then. Hmm, I see. Most illuminating. I'll update our Pokedex with this new data. I'm not going to say that every time. Because I think that's like a repeat. Uh, this Pokemon from Unova region. Uses a shell. Okay, we've read that. Uh, am I streaming Dream Daddy? Yeah. So I, I think it's Wednesday. Oh, I just did not pay attention to what he was saying there. But yeah, that's Wednesday for me. It'll probably be Tuesday for all of you guys. Or late Tuesday. 
But basically, the easiest way to put it is uh, think a day ahead. Like if it's wind, if it's Wednesday for you, it's probably Thursday for me. What do we got here? I saw the light, the light fading from the sky. You must have quelled the Lord Pokemon. What do you have there? Could it be? Ah, are those two Fable Plates of old? Please, let me have a look. I see, there are some letters carved into them. Let's see, this one says, where well, all creation was born. That is being's place of origin. That is the being's place of origin. God damn it, can't read. It seems to be a phrase from a very old myth. How did you come across these? I see. So you're given the plates when you're impressed. Why dear and Cleavor. I'm not going to get you to some of these Pokemon names. That's quite something, indeed. My heart is practically racing with incitement. Yes, bro, you look you look very excited. Is my guess that you find more plates like these scattered across you saw you saw you saw you saw I I still can't pronounce that. I really should have looked it up. I didn't. If we we should gather them all around and decipher the scripts on them. We may uncover something. May uncover something. Uh, which name? Uh, the name of the region. Uh, he su he su he su he su h i s u i. I mean, it's Japanese in nature. Yeah, it's Japanese in nature. So my thinking would be uh he. Sui. That would be my best guess, but I'm probably butchering it. Yes. Nah, yeah, we'll, we'll give it a shot. We'll see what happens. It's like that. Okay, sweet, sweet. Uh, the mysteries of the past. Oh. How they tickle my curiosity. What a joy to be alive in such times. Well, I must be on my way. Until next time. Yeah, I'm, I'm not great with, like, names and words. Like, English is my first language, and I can barely speak that properly. Whack in another language, oh, I'm screwed. But yeah, what you been up to? What, what you been up to, Dalios? Also, I hope I'm saying your name right. I keep... I, I feel like... I feel like I'm fucking it up. Dialogues. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm just like as fuck too. So um, I really should act. actually. I'm gonna do that now. I'm gonna increase. I'm gonna increase the size of this fucking font. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, that is much better. Probably has nothing to do with death though. Nah, that's good. Mind you, from some cultures, some words do that death do mean not do sort of bring unluck, don't they? Like the number four. We're not going to worry about that. At least not right now. Uh, you know I expect great things of you. Carry on the good fight out there. Okay, so what do you want me to do? Hmm. Well, it looks like that's where I need to go. Let's 
Just give me a sec, I'm just going to take a quick drink. Damn, only like 10 minutes in, I already feel like I'm losing my voice. We're in a professional outlet here. <clears throat> Time for some voice acting. Or what I call voice acting. Hmm, well done. I've already received the reports of your exploits. You successfully quelled Cleveland's frenzy, restoring peace of mind to the Sui people. You are a stranger to us, one who fell out of the very sky, yet you have served the Galaxy team admirably. I admit, you have earned yourself a degree of recognition. But th things are not settled yet. I have received word that there are other Pokemon nobles falling prey to such frenzies elsewhere. And Husui, Husui, come on, say it properly. Uh, so carry on with your research and survey duties and prove that you are truly an asset to us. That is all, you are dismissed. Your fellow survey corps members are likely to, are likely at the Wallflower. Go and join them. Hell oh, yeah, potato mochi. I need that. I was wondering if I had a reference sheet. I try to, I do have a thing here. Like my wee notebook. I just forget about it all the time to write shit. And I should. Wait, what's, what do you mean by reference sheet? Benny, you old chum. We're talking about like reference sheet and writing. Uh, the usual order. Three servings of potato mochi, please. I mean, as your model, uh, not not really. I mean, I kind of got this done through one of those Fiverr gigs, so it's not the it's not the ideal way. Is is that say potato? I got a fucking model. I know I'm starting to sound like a digital creator, but it's nothing like that. No, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I think you've been here long enough. That if, if you were planning something, I don't think we would mind you talking about it. As long as you don't come in going, hey, do you need overlays? Like all those wonderful bots do. Have you had any of those yet? Because they're fun. They're really fun. They've started getting real sneaky too. Like they're having like these more in-depth conversations. Like, they'll come over like, hello, how are you? How is your stream? Oh man, that's great. Like, you can say anything. Like, I could be like, man, my stream sucks. Everything's gone bad. OPS crashed. My computer's on fire. And they'll be like, oh man, that's great. Hey, I have a question to ask you. I, I, I quite enjoy screwing with them when we get them. I don't get them very often. But I think that has a lot to do with um, Seribot. I think Seribot deals a lot with those bot accounts too. I saw in the Ask Her game plan tips. Oh my god, they're getting they they they're getting trip they're getting sneaky. Have you had the ones on Twitter yet that where you put out a go live post? And they go, hey, could I talk to could could I ask you something about your stream? It's like, yeah, block. Mind you, I haven't had the ones that pop up in your DMs a lot lately. And then suddenly they ask, hey, can I ask you something? It's like, yeah. You, you know what they're up to. There's a uh, roboticness to how they interact compared to how we're talking right now. <clears throat> anyway, I digress. But yeah, no, no, no. Like, if, if I know you're a streamer and you hang here long enough, I don't mind talking shop. In fact, I quite enjoy it. It, it allows us to share ideas. My biggest fans on Twitter are bots. Oh my god, they're fucking everywhere. 
I just keep banning them. Otherwise, I keep showing up. They tend to come in waves, too. Like... I got... I think, like, I had about 10 of them follow me one day. A couple of months back. And now I've heard nothing. But that's not more. <clears throat> but, you know, we should probably continue with the uh, game here. Give me a sec. <clears throat> oh, and if there's anything I should recommend, by all means, bring it out. The whole village is gossiping up a storm about our young friend here, you know. He's got quite some luck to have come back unharmed after facing off against that cleaver. I dare say Trundle was well prepared. And he was quick study of how Cleaver moved in battle, from what I heard. All in all, it was a great show, a victory well earned. I threw stuff. That's basically what I did. We can feel safer going about the curves. Our survey core duties now, thanks to your efforts. Oh, by the way, why not try crafting some of these? I made a recipe based on directions ben Benny gave me. Smoke bombs. Um, no idea what smoke bombs are for. And now that we need not worry about being mauled by the cleave for either, let's take our chance to study all the Pokemon that call the Obsidian Fieldlands their home. Yeah, we do it stuff. Okay, get stared at. That's pretty sus. My name's... Uh, I've been waiting for you. My name's Vissa. There's something really important I need to tell you. Have you come with me? It's a declaration of love. Have, have we met... Have we met the, the, the one, the only... Um, this is kind of a secret. Something terrible has happened. Yisui is in a, a whole lot of danger. Oh, never mind. They only want me for my, uh, ability to solve problems. Why do I bother? Why do I have hope? I guess, I guess, uh, I guess I'll just be sitting eating a tub of ice cream this year for Valentine's Day. Hundreds of years, oh fuck, why does that remind me? That reminds me of a great story I'll tell after this. Hundreds of years ago, a being that brought calamity to this region was sealed away by someone using the power of a, stra of a strange magic. But now, for some reason, the magic has become undone and the seal is broken. I hate to think what might happen at this rate. So please, Trundle, hear me out. I need you to restore the broken seal. I don't believe you. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's a normal response to hearing such a strange story. I must sound crazy. But you just have to believe me. Can I give you this old keystone anyway? It'll help you see I'm telling the truth. I love how we've had this whole conversation of doom and gloom. We get a nice sweet up, upbeat obtained item jingle. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about anymore. Why do I try? That's right, because I've got to be entertaining. I'm a streamer. After the seal was broken, a whole bunch of wisps scattered across to Sui. 107 of them in total, damn. With the odd keystone I gave, you'll be able to gather... Oh god, it's a collection quest. See, the wisps are normally invisible, but not to the holder of the odd keystone. I know it's a huge task, but please, you just have to gather all the wisps for me. There's one real close to where we are now. How about you start with that one? 
See that flame hovering over there? Try touching it. Look, kid. I've been on this planet far too long to know not to touch random fire floating in the sky. Bad things happen. But hey, let's go touch it anyway, because I like adventure. Wisp has been absorbed into the odd keystone like it should have been, and why are you standing behind me? Thank goodness I picked you to help me with this. Come talk to me if you ever need help finding the remaining wisps. And one last thing, as you gather more wisps, I'll give you some reward as thanks. I'll wait here for you while you carry out your search. Good luck. Okay, clicks and quest. I'm, I dig it. The next day. Dot dot dot. Hello, Christy. How are you? No! What the heck? How is Rista? Dream drop distance. Next day, criminal graves of these flat. Oh. Christy, I have to explain these bruises, okay? Meh. Yeah. It's dream drop distance. What do you expect? I should finish that game one day. I. Oh. As soon as I left, as soon as you left, I made the dream make. Oh, what? The frog and okay, sweet. Well, missed it. But yeah, an orange froggy. <gasps> orange. Man, I need to finish that game sometime though. I just got over how stupid Sora was in the story. Like, the whole plot could have been avoided if Sora took a moment to think. It was stupid. And the game kind of pissed me off. Yeah, there's, there's a reason I stopped playing. The, the stupidness and, and the fact that I was, like, just finishing off like a boss and, the, and, then, it, and then it switched characters on me. I wasn't happy. But wow... The Galaxy Team hairdresser really is, I dare say, cutting edge. But oh yeah, uh, just to let you know, Christy, uh, the Dilo's VT there is uh, that's my. Remember my. stop making jokes mind you I didn't write that one I was just saying it oh hey you're Trundle the boy who quelled Cleaver aren't you uh, who's to say don't know what you're talking about hey you can't fool me you got quite the reputation you know I mean you quelled what a almighty Sino chosen ones some people are usually are actually kind of scared of you for doing something so bold. Good. Fear means control, and I control this land. I'm Erizu, by the way. I butchered that name most likely. I'm a warden of the Diamond Clan. My special skill is giving haircuts. Real nice to meet you. Oh snip! <laughs> Get it? Cause she's a. She's a hairdresser. But I came here to talk to you, Mr. Kamado. See you around. I 
Okay, so that mean we could like get a haircut? What Quorum do I use for my VTuber? Uh, I use VTube Studio. Oh, uh, also I found out exactly how to do the speech thing. I would show you, but I use a virtual camera for my VTube. But basically you set up in the main settings, you turn that on. You turn that on so your voice will go through your microphone. And then you have to go in, oh geez, knock on the mic. Um, then you have to go into your model settings. So where you can adjust all that sensitivity stuff. Go down to your mouth open and mouth smile. And there should be something called like, um, I think it's called like, for the input. Give me a sec. If I can find the right button to do. Uh, give me a sec. Give me a sec. I think I can do this. Give me a sec. I'll try this. How about this? Hopefully it doesn't show anything too. Give me a sec before I do. I'll make sure it doesn't uh, show anything you don't need to see. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, okay. So, Christy, if you, uh, look at this, I'm giving you a wee back seat. So, if you come down to this setting here, so you've got all this stuff, uh, you c I've got to play around with this a wee bit, actually, to be honest. But if you use microphone, select your microphone, then you want to come over to this one here. You want to come down to mouth smile, and it should have the input for voice frequency plus mouth smile. And voice volume plus mouth open. So you set that up, and it should work nicely. So yeah, let's head back on over. So yeah, that, that helps. I can, uh, more than happy. Wait, scroll up. Uh, I can go, th I can, uh, there, there, there. Fine, just for you, Christy, just for you. Didn't think you applied that one thing, so yeah. Basically, go to mouse smile, set that up there. And mouth open. And that basically, um, because I basically have my microphone right in front of me, so it can sometimes block off the thing. But there is still, it still will capture your mouth over the, uh, thing. Also, uh, it's probably one of the really, so hello, hello Luna, how are you? Welcome in. I'm just, I'm just giving Christy a wee hand with some stuff. The thing over the thing, yeah, the thing over the thing. What this do? It does thing, it makes a shark. I mean, I've worked on the shark quite nicely. As in, I, 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 I edited this picture out, so we just have the shark, so I've got to use them. It was for the... What about the mouth open? Oh, um, volume plus mouth open. So, yeah, I, I, I have to make use of them. I like shark. Not baby shark though, baby shark annoys me. Yeah, uh, Dilos, this was a wee while back. Uh, I think the bot might be on YouTube. And the output for that one, oh, uh, volume mouth open, basically. And you should be pretty sweet. Uh, eh. Ow. 
Got it. Sweet. Okay. Yeah, where we going? Here we go. How do I get the things right at you? That's a little bit different. Uh, for that, I'm using a wonderful program known as Tits. The uh, Twitch integrated throwing system. It's like 30 bucks, though, unfortunately. But I can tell you this, I got my money's worth. I really got my money's worth. But yeah, that we uh, shark emote is one we did on stream. I think there are other programs you can use for throwing, but I, I never figured them out. I, I just got tits because it was easy to set up. And it's basically another overlay you have to put on. So there's like three separate uh, video sources on this scene alone. Got the Elgato, I got the Ow. 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 But yeah, I got the Elgato, I got BeatTube Studio, which is a camera source. I'm just trying to help. You done? We'll give it a sec. I'm watching. But anyway, let's go do some stuff. Ow. Suffer, I got too many pizzas IRL now, I need to throw them at you. I actually ran out of pizzas the other day. I gotta get some more. I like having like a little uh, little meat pies and and then pizzas in the freezer. Like if I if I need a good quick cook up, because I'm a lazy fucker. Also, why is that not working? That should have some bottles thrown at me. Give me a sec. I'll fix it. Sound alert's broken. Um, shouldn't be. Give me a sec. Where is a sound alert? You know, I tried color coding these and I can't remember for the life of me what it is. Here we go, try that. Oh, it is broken. Um, God, everything's broken today. Okay, we'll try it this way then. Is that gonna work? Okay, why is sandal is broken? Gonna fix it. Okay, so why did that 
Why did Mustachio Question not work? And Shark did. Oh my god, it's all broken. Because I was telling you this Chris, last night, Christy. Things broken. It all works until it doesn't. Uh, use OBS. Because my browser source is broken, that's why. Okay, 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 we're gonna do this. Browser source is offline. Why is it offline? Everything's broken. Okay, one more try, and then we'll uh, we'll just carry on. Okay. Okay, so I may have to restart OBS. Screw that. We'll uh, we'll, we'll, we'll not worry about it. We'll just continue on. I'm sorry, Luna. I will try and fix that for you as soon as I can. And I'll give you some freebies. But while I am, I will test this one. Yeah, okay, nah, it's broken. <laughs> I do apologize about that. Okay, we'll just we'll just continue on. Hey Trindu, hey Matt, how you doing? Welcome back. I do, I do apologize if uh, we have just found out everything is broken. Browser source is everything. So I'll, I'll have we play around after stream today. How you doing? Welcome in. Oh, so hello, Madam Guillotine. How are you as well? Uh, definitely, I am. I am a master of fashion. But yeah, it's one of those things that happens. It could have been when I was playing around. I, I could have just like broken everything. I see you well. I have a duty of making this village more fashionable. Hell yeah. Uh, doing well. Just did some writing on Pokemon Go. Then got a shiny. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, it was a fixed my sleep schedule after destroying while playing Power World. Power World, the destroyer of all sleep schedules. But yes, I study fashion. You're part of the survey corps, right? Oh, excuse me. 
Hello, just hanging out today? Hey, no problem. Feel free to sit back, relax. Get yourself a nice cup of tea. Uh, it's good to see you. Uh, also, since you're doing makers and crafting, what were you up to? I'm actually kind of curious. Now, I've been told that Hippopa Hippopotas, which can be found around the Crimson Mylands, have different appearances based off their gender. I feel like if I were able to see and compare them, it would inspire me to create new designs. Okay. Could you show me both a male and female Hippopotas? Uh, it's doing some insect taxidermy and stuff with resin. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I knew someone who was into that sort of stuff as well. I was at... I just mind my own business at work. And out of nowhere, she comes up, she's like, Oh, wait, 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 come here, come here, come here, look, come here, look what I got. I'm just, no, okay. So she got delivered to work. So I go, okay, well, what the fuck do you want? Why are you so excited? It's unusual for you to be excited. You're normally dead and soulless like the rest of us. And when she pulls out this box, a, uh, like, a taxidermy bat. It was impressive. Unexpected, too. <clears throat> so, it's come to... Ursaluna as well, Ursaluna. It's a weird name. This suggests that even Pokemon that are not nobles can become frenzied. I have received no word from Adamant or Irida. But this morning's not something that we can simply ignore. In any case, you have my thanks, Miss Azu. Irizu. Irizu. You did well to inform us of Saluna's situation. No problem, Adam. He's got his hands full running our clan and all. And Saluna's warden wouldn't even give me the time of day. So Galaxy Team are the only ones I could turn... God, I fucking hate some of the names they have in this. Uh, I could turn it to about this... Uh, Miss... Miss Calibur? Calibur? Of the Pearl Clan, is it not? One of, the, of all the wardens, she's the most narrow-minded and bound by tradition. She likely does not ca take kindly to outsiders meddling in her affairs. I have a new message for you, Trundle. I order you to study your Saluna and... Crimson Mylands. I permit you to show your strength if necessary. Hell yeah, let's kick some ass. Who's that? Hey Rose, welcome in. How is Red Dead Redemption? I hope you're enjoying it. Uh, one, three, five, six, eight. Seven, five, three, two. Welcome in. Welcome. Uh, Rose, welcome. Thank you for the raid. Uh, for those who don't know me, I am Trundle, Crundle, or some have called me Mr. Late for dinner. Uh, welcome in. Today we're just playing Pokemon. Yeah, that's about it. But I hope you're doing well. Not really, unfortunately. Too slow for me. Yeah, it... It's... It does take a bit to get into... Like, to really get into everything. Unfortunately, it is a fantastic game. It is well written. The characters are awesome. But yeah, it does take a while to pick up. And like, start really getting into like, what it's all about. Yeah, we got Matt here. It's also nice to know that my uh, alerts are working. So there's that. 
we've uh, had the uh, unfortunate situation of everything's broken. So like sound alerts, most stuff is just broken. But hey, we'll just make the most of it. Also, I just need to make sure I'm not lurking myself. That sucks. Yeah, it does, but it happens. I'm hoping it's just a matter of... I just need to restart OBS. But, um... Yeah, because I was messing around way too much uh, earlier, getting some stuff fixed. Like, I fixed up a few things or so. Hello, Katya. How are you today? Oh. Uh, hello, human. You may call me whatever you wish to care, as long as you're creative. I'm predominantly called 13 or 20, uh, 32. Numbers work too. Oh, hell yeah. And thank you for giving me some laughter. Hell yeah, that, that's what we're all about here. Having a good time, chilling. To be honest, I, I'm kind of surprised myself. I managed to read every single number in your name. I I, have, I tend to like just stutter and be horrible at names. Uh, thanks. Also, thanks for shout out. I'm doing well. How about you? Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. We, we're just chilling today. The reason why I get laughed is because part of my name is just for that one person who will read it. It brings me joy. My math. See, I, li I like to attempt people's names. Like, if I ever fuck up your name, just, just let me know. Yeah, well, so, but yeah, I'm doing well, Couchy, as well. I hope Scotland's going well, or are you, or are you back? Either way, I hope you're doing so. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're safe. All that good stuff. Uh, my math just looks you never could. I used to be pretty horrible at maths until I went into tertiary education. Uh, the tutor I had at Polytech was fantastic. Like, she did such a great job. Uh, gonna de-stream, not feeling very well at the moment. Hey, no problem. You go rest up. So thank you for the raid as well. I shall take good care of your community. Or ruin everything. It, it could go either way at this point. But yes, if you need to de-stream, please do so. Go look after yourself. Uh, I'm still here for a bit, leaving after this week. It's been nice so of you chilling. Hey, no problem. It's alright, just... Yeah, sit back, relax, have a cup of tea. It goes to everyone as well. We're just chilling. Have some snacks. Do stuff. Just make yourself comfy. That that's that's what it really is. That's what it's all about. And you can watch me mispronounce every single word in this game. Uh, not know what a Pokemon is. And all around be not good. Ow. I think everything's broken. Okay, I've broken it more. Well, that might be why. Because that's up here. Okay, I think I've fixed everything. Kinda. Uh, if you mess up my name, it also brings me... So thank you for the, uh, for the follow. Uh, 32. 13. I'll figure something out later. Um, if you mess up my name, it also brings me laughter because I can take the piss out of you from that. Yeah. Yeah, believe me. If you, if, you, if you want to take the piss out and mispronounce some words, you come to the right place. Give me a storyteller vibes and I'm here for it. I hate to say I'm not a very good storyteller. I'm rubbish. I can't, I can't tell a story to save myself, but yeah. 
I do hope you enjoy your time here. And you find you find something that uh Yeah. So yeah, just just sit back, relax, do all the good stuff, and we shall uh continue on. You sound like you have the voice despite using otherwise <laughs> pretty much I get that one a lot. But the next mission will be sent is to investigate the Crimson Mylands. You will find Pokemon living there. To be more fearsome than other and the, oh that reminds me sorry stories i do have a few reading streams planned i've just got to collect a couple of books so uh if, if you have anything you'd like to uh have read here let me know i'll see if i can find it because i've got a hitchhiker's guide to the galaxy uh, was it Oh, uh, the Vampire Cosmonaut, that's pretty good too, if you like uh, your light novels. But yeah, that, that's planned for some time. I haven't got a pen. I've kind of got it penciled in. Not really at the moment. I've got a lot going on. Uh, you'll find Pokemon living there that are more fierce than these obsidian fieldlands. Even the landscape itself is harsher, with steep ravines, seaside cliffs. It's not welcoming. You must be a second star to face the Mylands. Complete research tasks and help fill out the Pokedex if you hope to move up the ranks. Do so by catching Pokemon and conducting your survey work in areas you currently have access to. Uh, I was just making a bed and I got scared to help. I mean, like my heart felt kind of scared just because my underwear was wrapped in the blanket and I'll speak to see it. I've done that before. Oh shit, it's a rat. Sort of, sort of moment. How am I? I'm doing pretty good. I've got a wee bit of a weird headache, but it seems to be passing. So we'll, we'll see. Also, I'm lost. I am very lost. Here we go. Ah, that's right, I was going to think I could have become a two star. So we'll pick up some of these uh, side quests, see what everyone's up to. Ah, just the person I was waiting for. There's a Pokemon I was hoping you could bring me. Been trying to make business of offering the groundbreaking experience of having your photo taken with Pokemon. But no one around here seems to understand the appeal. Or perhaps they're just too afraid of Pokemon to get over their re reluctance. But it happened. But I happened to accidentally catch a Pokemon in this photo, and it gave me a brilliant idea. Okay. Uh, also, just a wee heads up, ads are going to start in about a couple of minutes. So if you need to uh, stretch your legs, take a break, all that good stuff, you know, definitely do so. I'll try not to do anything. You're probably not going to miss much at the moment. I'm just clicking some side quests. See how fluffy it is? How adorably soft, how irresistibly, impossibly cuddly. Once people see Pokemon like this in a photo, they want to have their portraits taken together with it. I need you to get a better shot of it than this one. If you find one, could you bring it here? Okay, so we've got to go find a wee Pokemon with fluffy things. Yeah, I think we can we can do that. I do like that there's a fair few side quests to do. Hey sport, interest you in some target practice? All you've got to do is lob some balls and try to pop some balloons. Easy peasy, fun and breezy. Even got some fine prizes lined up to give out depending on how well you do. 
If you manage to break 10,000 points, you'll be in for a real treat. I can tell you that. If you're up for a challenge, just let me know. I'm usually found in the practice field. Okay, we can we can do that. Where's the practice field? It's down here, isn't it? Get a score of 10,000 points would be easy. My aim is impeccable. That's going to come back to bite me in the ass, isn't it? So basically, we've got to throw some shit balloons. I, I like the sound of that. Line up lost targets, pop a lot per ball. Practice, practice, practice. It's best I got. Manage to break 10,000 points, you get a real try. Okay. Yeah, why not? Hopefully it doesn't charge us to keep doing it. This isn't good. Okay, how are we at? 8,000? Oh, yeah, we got this. Easy. Oh, look at that. Smashed it out. We've absolutely smashed this one out. Easy. Uh, I'm not sure I remember. I think the yellow one are worth more. Yeah. Oh, I think combos give you more time from the looks of it. Yeah, no, we smashed that. Ah, also 32, thank you for uh, for the lurk. Enjoy your lurk. Keep safe. Have fun. All that good stuff. Hopefully we'll see you again soon. Uh, now, isn't that something you've set yourself on record? Well done. Like I said, I've got prizes lined up to give out depending on how well you do. Based on your score this time, here's a prize just for you. Leaden balls. Now, an improvement upon the original heavy ball design. Ball is too heavy to fly far, but it's highly effective if you manage to hit. Okay. Well done. Since you broke through the 10,000 point mark, you get a real prize. So we've got, oh, damn, 15 great balls and a nugget. Fucks and nugget. Yeah, I'm sure we'll figure it out later. Don't think you got to stop here. You keep aiming higher, kid. Play on. You get better all the time. The better you do, the better prizes I'll hand out. Okay, so we can keep going there. So as we get better, we just get better prizes. Okay, I'm down for that. Alrighty. Let's see what else we got to do. You're the boy from the survey call, aren't you? Thank good. Also, welcome back everyone from the ad break. I appreciate your patience, and I hope you manage to get... Do something, like... Have a, have a snack. Stretch your legs, all that stuff. Uh, but yeah, we, we, we just did the ball thing. We absolutely smashed the 10,000 point limit. It was great. But yeah, thank goodness we came along. Could I ask you to fetch a plant for me? I need to use it to make some medicine. The plant I'm after has three leaves and tastes bitter enough to make you dizzy. Unfortunately, I don't know where it grows. Try asking... 
energy from the medical core. She'll be able to point you in the right direction. The search for bitter leaves. Whatever that means. Hey, listen to this. I saw something out in the wilds. Oh, it was incredible. Uh, come again. The thing I saw was a below the wisp. A ball of bright red fire. When I was walking on the windsweep run the other night, it leaped to me like, Ooh. Yes, thank you. And it again with this story. Don't just turn, mister. My big sis always gets carried away with her fairy tales. But for goodness sake, I'm not making it up. I saw that willow of the wisp with my own two eyes. Oh yeah? Then why don't you show it to me, eh? <laughs> Good luck with that. Speaking of whips, we, we can see them now too, can't we? So that'll be fun. It's frustrating, you won't believe me. Honestly, I did see one. You say you're at the Survey Corps, right? And I hear you're quite the prodigy. I bet you could easily, easily catch a willow of wisp. Do you think you could catch the one I saw and bring it back here? Maybe we can give it a go. I mean, I've got no idea what we're doing. What we're looking for. But if it's like the other wisp, we can see it. Easy. Uh, yes, we're heading outside. Uh, we'll go to... Go to the Heights Camp. Because we do have a few things we need to go and have a look at. I have some questions for a slumber for you. May I ask them received honest answers? Yeah, go for it. I'll answer as honestly as I can. I tend to be a pretty open book depending on the questions. And if you're asking me anything about Pokemon, I've got no clue. Uh, what name do I refer to you as? Um, well, a lot of people call me Trundle, Crundle, some sort of variation of that, so... But, I don't mind, you can come up with your own wee nickname if you like. To me, it's kind of a mean, like, meaningless name sort of thing. Am I catching more sea money? You could be sea money too if you like. But also, hey Mike, how you doing? Oh. Oops. I've forgotten how to play. But yeah, we catching them all. Uh, possibly. Oh, and also, if anyone would. I've got two more Pokemon that need to be named. So if anyone would like to name one of my Pokemon on my team oh I'll bring it up in a second what are they I uh, give me a second so we have a Lucio I th well, Luxio I think it's Lucio and a Ponyta Uh, what are my preferred pronouns? Well, I kind of go by he, him, but you can use whatever you like. I'm not terribly fussy on that sort of stuff. Uh, Aqua Jet. Favorite color? Blue. That's the only thing I ever ask, because never mistake my favorite color for anything else but some shade of blue. Uh, sparks? I don't know if I have one of those. But yeah, I've got a ponytail in one of these things. So if, if you'd like to name either one of those. 
But yeah, we got to uh, do it. We got Dylos. Uh, do you care if I call you Bluebird? No, you all good to call me that. I don't mind. Spark. Oh, okay. Um. Okay, I am with you now. Sparks. Here we go. Cool. There we go. Sparks Lucio. Luxo. Yeah, I didn't get it fixed, uh, Luna. I'm hoping it's just a restart OBS kind of thing. But don't worry, next time you're here, Luna, I'll, I'll give you like a few freebies. So, come in. Oh, you little shit. I kind of want to fight that thing down there. I think it's quite a high level. You are not better than Yaoi Hands. Uh, if I was to draw myself as a character in the book, what character would you be? Hmm. Well, that is actually a good question. Uh, we use quick attack. Oh, that tells you think about that one. But I'm generally a pretty quiet person. Let's see, we'll I'll switch out to do it. But yeah, I'm generally pretty quiet. Keeps myself sort of character. That's probably the best way. Uh, I'd, I'd put it. Or if you want to really, uh, damn, it depends on the kind of book, book too. Like, is it comedy? Is it serious? Is it an autobiography? An unwise, wise person. There we go. Use that. I can spout. Me I can have many moments of wisdom, but God forbid I actually follow my own advice. sneak up on it but yeah no I'd really have to think about that one uh, that's it for 30 we're not fighting that let's just get the hell out of here I mean, we could take it on but I don't know exactly what it is Ooh. Uh, let me know when you have a reply for free to message me yeah I'll do that or I'll forget if, if I forget remind me but yes I'm definitely keen on answering that because that, I, I fucking love that question but I'm not really sure how to answer it Uh, if you forget to message, you... does that work with you? Yeah, no, no. Like if if you've got some question like that, and I say I'll get back to you, and I forget, yeah, just just flip me like I th I can't remember if I got my DMs closed off on Twitch or not. But yeah, yeah, I tend to. But yeah, just feel free to message. Yeah, just feel free to message me. Or pop in during the stream and re-ask. Because I will probably work on that. That one got sword stance. Okay, so why is all that broken? Okay, okay, things are broken.
Okay, it worked. Why did the other one not? Oh, right, we will be fine. Uh, tackle. I have three friends and friends are all quite reserved. Yeah, we... Yeah, it's probably a good way to put it. Like, it's... I think we have a very... Uh, no, I want to try and use that. See if we can catch it. It's got a fancy moustache. But yeah, we're definitely... I'd say we're definitely quite reserved. We're very good at having our social groups as well. And we tend to be friendly to most people. But like, in saying that though, you'll know when you piss us off. And we tend to be... Uh, And we tend to, um, we tend to be a bit iffy when bringing new people in, if that makes sense. And that's something I've noticed more. That's something I only really noticed recently when I, uh, because I moved across, across, across the country. And it's really hard to, like, I was going to join a D&D &D group, but... You really have to know people who know people to get in. Kinda sucked. Oh, you little shit. It's okay to forget to be human is to error, exactly. We are but merely flawed. Also, what the hell is that iron chunk? Let's just keep moving. So next rank, uh, first time in. Okay, so we can pretty much go do that now. I do kind of want to see. What I need, so I need number defeated. Cool, without being spotted. So catch him without being spotted. That should be pretty. Oi! None of that. Enemy to miss you due to certain miss. Okay, yeah, because I I, sh I shut off my. I know I shut off my DMs on Twitch because I keep getting the scammers come through. But uh, also shameless plug. We also do have a Discord for anyone who's interested. So it's also another way to kind of keep in touch. But yeah, don't 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 feel any pressure to join though. Uh, number of caught without being spotted. Number of caught without defeat. Number of given food. Okay. God damn it. Oh, okay, okay. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, so, okay, so this is where he hides out. I wonder if I could sneak up on him. Uh, just because we're broken, I will just ask another time. I've made note to make sure. Okay, awesome. Because I've, I've also made note to at least come up with an answer for the question. Also, what the hell is that? So 
times I've seen it use Equijet. Hmm. It's fine. No, just ignore me. Okay, yeah, we hands go. In the mud slap. He's fixed that on there, so I can quickly not do that. We'll do that. Well, I mean, the more we catch, the better, right? I got here that I could potentially here we go ow did that pizza come out of nowhere did it work I didn't see it did the pizza come through because could you oh, there it is I heard it Stretch. Uh, give me a sec. I'll do those in just a quick second. Right. So we have a hydrate, which for some reason wasn't working. Okay, that might be why that wasn't working. Yeah, I've still got a wee bit of work to do. But yes, everyone else, make sure you hydrate as well. We got a stretch and a posture check, so... better. Hopefully when this new office chair arrives, I'll um... The, the posture will be a lot better. Because unfortunately I've uh... Got this old ass seat. I mean I've had it for years, so I'm, I'm quite happy with it. But uh, it's just getting too old and... It's just, just easy to get a new one. Right, catch him. We'll see if we can get a couple of these Zubats too. Which Pokemon's my favourite? Um, like the ones I've got so far, or like my favourite Pokemon in general. Because unfortunately, I don't have much Pokemon knowledge. Alright, we'll deal with this. Uh, do a quick attack in strong style. K. 
Okay, nice. Right, out of all the ones I've got so far... But out of the Pokemon I've got so far, I it's tough because I actually quite like them all. Sick. Where is it? See, I quite like um, like this. I kind of like Sparks here because it, it's like a weird monkey cat thing, and it's blue. Uh, we got a Oshawa, which is evolved. He's quite cool. Eevee's adorable. I know Eevee because I got a mug with Eevee written on it. It's right here too. Um, and Yowie Hands, he's pretty nice. Got some big fists. And Opponent is pretty decent. Like, I don't know, I like all the ones I've got so far. But yeah, so far it has to be uh, the sweet fella. Uh, why do I say bad storytelling? Maybe it's not the right story for you to read out loud. Um, yeah, probably. I'm not very good at talking, believe it or not. Yeah, we hands a big fist, that's a combination. Oh damn, is it ever? I, I think you can I think you can guess who uh name the Geo dude. I'm not gonna lie, I'm here for it. Where the hell am I going? But yeah, I'm, I'm generally not very good. My voice is generally quite monotonous. That, that's a word. I looked it up. But yeah, I'm generally very monotone. Especially when I have to think about things and talk at the same time. And ooh, hello. Should go with But like I think I think the storytelling is also practice. You know, you kinda of gotta get used to telling stories. But, you, you know, I don't think I'm great at streaming. I think I still got a long way to try and figure shit out. But I, I like to think I figured it. I'm, I'm figuring it out at least. Uh, understand the manner of which you speak is not within the same way words are written or is intended to be read. Yeah. Pretty much kind of sums it up. Ah, here we go. Camp. Ah, uh, Galaxy Member. No, we're going to talk to Leventon. Yes. So, 1600, nice. Okay, cool. So, yeah, this is basically... Also, do I have any new... Uh, we've carried out some fine work. I believe we're ready for the next rank. Sweet. About time. Best you report to Captain Selene, eh? I'd get right on that if I were you. So, what would we like to do? Uh... We'll stay here for a bit. Uh, I do not think it's because of the way your voice is. I think it's because you have not used or discovered the use of your voice within conversing with another. Am I creating? Uh, yeah. 
yeah, pretty much. It's like, it's... Oh, God, like... There's another streamer that... I've kind of talked to a fair bit about this when I've hanging out in the chat. Like, the idea of... Like, what it is to discover your voice. Like, well, what, like what do you have to say? I think that's part of the problem. I don't really know what I want to say. But hello, JP. The Pokemons goes good. And I am good. How are you? How was the... How was Evil Within? Did you uh, end up finishing it? Or have you got a uh, little more to do? It was good, beat it, hell yeah. Uh, also, to anyone, to, to both you, JP, and to anyone else, we still have a ponyto that, um... Shoot, if I can get into it. We still have a ponyto that we need to name. So if anyone would like to suggest a name, I'm more than happy to do so. You want to be the ponyto, Christy? I mean, I was going to wait for a Snorlax, but, you know. So, would you like to be, have it named after yourself, or would you like to choose the name? Shut up. <laughs> See, the problem is, Christy, you should never have told me about the Snorlax story. You'd never hear the end of it. Is Ponyta a girl? No, uh, Ponyta is male. I think I think most of them are male. I don't Yeah no the only one is uh Sparks here. Christy has pox on streams. Christy does have pox got Sonic streams. Ten out of ten recommend. Go find one. I oh. Uh, no, Sparks has already been taken, unfortunately. You're a bit late there. Yeah, it's just the Ponyta. Unless I have another one. Uh, Pokemon, let's see. Yeah, no, I've got nothing. Also, we need to go put some of this away. Um, hmm. But yeah, if you'd like to, if you still like to name it, you can still come up with a name. I don't mind. I think most of this can just go away. Could call it crispy. Oh, we could. Oh, I discovered your voice sounds exactly like you s sound like a professor of psychology. That I mean, I can be done with that. I am planning a science stream, which has gone nowhere. But yes, we shall name it. Yeah, I was just going to be doing a wee uh, tour of the solar system, test the waters. 
Uh, can I spell? No, actually, I like it with a W. Okay, so we got Quispy. Now we now have our full team. Can you name the next one cute? Yeah, like, we can name all of them. Uh, I'm just starting with the main team. And, you know, I'll switch people out. I'll switch Pokemon out as I, as I see fit. But what we got now is pretty robust. But we can... Ow. What's that? Uh, thank you for the follow, Dr. Despair. Despair, Dr. God, I'm sorry. My brain switched that around pretty quickly. But yeah, thank you for the thank you for the follow. Uh, you're looking for some Pokemon stuff today, or just just browse and twitch. If I get Alakazam, I want my name after me. Okay, okay, JP. There is an Alakazam. I know where it is, but it keeps teleporting. I think that's Alakazam. I'm going to get it. So what was I doing? That's right. Uh, return to the village. But yes, sir, Doctor, I hope you're doing well. Hope everything is all good. Could be the next Astrum. What the hell's an Astrum? Yeah, full disclaimer, I don't know what Pokemon is. I'll look that up. Oh, the YouTube channel. Um, do I like surprise because I have one for you? Um, depends on the surprise. That's right, we got these little things last time, didn't we? I'm not generally the one who likes surprises. I, I like to know things, I like to figure things out. Like, if you keep something from it, like you keep a secret. Like, like if you were planning a surprise birthday, I would be trying to figure that out. Uh, probably the biggest astronomy or physics YouTube, at least the most visible ones I know. Was for, oh, okay. But yeah, I'm... I really enjoy space and like astronomy and stuff. But my real passion is biology. I fucking love biology so much. Uh, also, yes, we have made progress. If you have progress to report, I will judge its worthiness. Show me your Pokedex. Uh, Bunnery. Oh, that's one we have to get a picture of. Okay, so I think we're doing pretty good. But I'm sure we'll like the surprise. Okay, what is it? Uh, hmm, you have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. Okay, that might be why Tits was broken. Give me a sec. Okay, I fixed it. Uh, you two try find the star and planet combination 318B. Do not ask me to find it or for a clue for it. Okay, we can have a wee peek around for that in a wee bit. Uh, with this, you have officially attained the rank of second star of the Galaxy Expedition Team. 
Can I use feather balls? Pokemon Absolute will 30 wood back. Okay, sweet. Rewards you earn for survey points will be generous. Okay, more crafting receipts. Uh, so, feather balls. Uh, Apricorn Sky Tumble Stone. And Super Potions. Hell yeah. Ow. Hello, hello, KS. Welcome. Also, I haven't seen you in a while. How you doing? Hope you're okay. Hope you're okay. Uh, happy hunting. You may definitely find something intriguing about their star combination. Okay, now I have to. Ow. What was that? I think I pressed the button. These nuts are just fine. Oh god. Sorry, I'm, I'm looking up the star system now. There's something. Uh, what's it? 138B? Uh, guess what? Ooh, what's up? Uh, here's the star. If you start level up as a pizza party, hell yeah. Everyone loves a good pizza party. So, what do we got? Uh, cool Kepler 138B, the first exoplanet smaller than, smaller than Earth. Okay, because quite often we find ones that are bigger. Uh, to have both its mass and size measured, the exoplanet is the innermost of three planets orbiting Kepler 138. It's also known as Koya 3004, location in the constellation Lyra, approximately 200 light years away. Ooh, interesting. I'm going to have to do a bit more reading here. Wait, was this the one they thought had the alien megastructure? Or well, they thought there was life here as well? I know it was one of the Kepler. Sorry, I'm reading. Uh, for the study of the planets will provide understanding that diversity that exists in nature and help us determine if rocky planets like Earth are more common or rare. I th yeah, because I, I remember correctly, I think. Like in terms of planets, planetary systems themselves are something like only 15% of known stars in our galaxy, approximately. So planetary systems are basically, they're just stars that have planets. That's the easy way to put it. And I think only like 15% of stars actually have planetary systems. Interesting? Nah, not interesting. Uh, at your current rank, you should be able to handle the Crimson Mile Lands all through. And, and surprise and courage actually still exists. Despite everything you experienced, like, thank you for that otherwise. I have not met such a wonderful, great human being with this fascination of stars and my eyes beyond the atmosphere. Oh my god, thank you. I salute you. I, I am saluting. But yeah, I, I do like the idea that there's stuff out there. Uh, your destination is a place with in the Mylands known as the Solius on Solikion Ruins. I, I don't, I'm not going to bother. Let's just go. Uh, in his home, they may have found followed by something alien related. You can guarantee that he remotely closed that. But the media is like 0% chance. Good enough. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Well, the thing is, most of the time they go, Ooh, there's an alien megastructure. It's probably something casting a shadow on the planet. 
or casting a wee shadow on the sun, more like it, that's how we find them. But do I think alien life is out there? Most likely. Do I think it's common? I don't know. I mean, if you take the amount of time that also hello guess what's going on here we're talking about aliens and shit but like you, you know if we are the first like there's theoretically like i think there's life out there regardless is life that's reached a point of us maybe we're the only ones so far or maybe they've been ones before us we don't know like it's when you take into account a 13 billion here lifespan of the universe whatever it is 13 14 billion now i reckon it's like we've only been here for a few million years at best well i'm very fascinated but they almost been all of june to august closely following david the grocery situation what was that i missed that space man is expected <laughs> but yes case how are you Cass? what's up welcome in uh, also, uh, <clears throat> while you're answering that, I'll continue this. Oh, hello, Trundle. I was getting the itch to battle you, to battle with you, and now you're here. That must be a sign. You're right. I can't wait to beat your Pikachu in submission again. Let's have a fine battle so I can grow closer with my Pikachu. Uh, Nippy is playing Ghostwire Tokyo. And maybe we'll watch Master Chef with me. Ooh, nice. How's Master Chef? Um, oh, just be careful with, uh, like, potentially making something the Twitch thing could make a link. Unfortunately, uh, for whatever reason, Mixed Up likes to. Wow, whatever's I'm using to mod that. I do have links disabled, so um, just, I don't know, try, try using a slash. It's as a dot, that might help. Uh, Sheffy, yeah, it's pretty Sheffy. Uh, right, also, we got to kick Pikachu's ass. Oh, she got him. whatever the fuck that thing is. Uh, Cass must leave for a few, and then I will be lurking. I have got to get into the bed now. Fair enough, Cass. Need to rest, rest. I know it's quite late for a lot of you guys. Over, over in the, uh, other side of the world. Um. Well, let's it. High ranking intelligence officer in the US government. The secret UFSO retrieval program. Operated ran by black companies contracted out by the government. No. I might have to have a wee look into this. Oh god damn it. Okay, do it. You got this. Let's kick some ass. Ah, uh, check to score. I will in a quick second. Huge congressional hearing about this in August, July. So something's gone down? Or like he's been whistleblowing? Possibly. Um. Jet. Who's that? So, hello, Jelly. How you doing? How was he powered last night? I was uh, doing a lot of working and lurking last night. It's quite good, actually. I got quite a wee bit done. He and a few others testified under oath about the things they witnessed. Ooh. So basically, they've been... Uh, Interesting. I think I might have heard something about that in passing. 
Oops, I keep finding myself caught observing the way Pokemon use their moves. Nah, that's pretty sweet. You'll get it. But yeah, I think I've heard something about that, like, in passing. It's like a big thing. But, like, all these people came out, talked about, like, shit they've seen. Like, aliens exist, all that stuff. So it'll be kind of interesting. Two sapphires in the sky, though. 138, whatever. Unfortunately, that's all put through as a link. So I might have to. Unless that's been done on purpose. I don't have we pick it to school too. Also, nice cast. Uh, thank you for battling with me. Here, have this new recipe. Stealth sprays. So I've been working on studying those strange space uh, space time distortions. Do you know the ones I mean? They've been appearing here and lately. It seems they are holding wonderful items, but f frighteningly strong Pokemon too, if you plan to go. But be careful about it. Now it's time to head to Myland's camp. Uh, I don't believe the government is hiding aliens. The government is literally the people who started the conspiracy. But aliens are for one, and they intentionally get people's attention from the actual secret. Yeah, I don't believe they are holding aliens. Like if if aliens have the ability to get here, right? Do do you really think? Do do you really think they would get caught so easily? Uh, thank you so much. You've piqued an intrigue upon many matters that have been left untouched for quite some time. Now the layers of dust will tell you as much. That's the thing. That's actually almost that's ominous. Something's gonna happen. Uh, it was wild and cat thing story. I also f I also follow the work of Harvard researcher Avi Lobi, who believes. Not to mention the fact people who work there are forbidden from talking about things, as people think that. Yeah, no, no. Like, it is classified stuff, but. I, th I think, yeah, I kind of agree with you. It's like something the government would make up to keep away from a real secret. And I think it just over time became like pop culture stuff and people are dumb enough to believe it. Also, thank you for my, for my intrigue into other matters beyond my eyes on the ground. Instead, you've taught me to look beyond the stars within sight. You're welcome. I'm glad for provoking intrigue. I, I quite enjoy talking about stars and stuff. I don't know everything. I'm pretty stupid. But by God, if you want to talk about it, I'm going to talk about it. Uh, right, like then cross galaxies, but parallel parking is too complicated. I don't know, man. Parallel parking is quite complicated. I mean, it took me a while to figure it out myself. <laughs> Like, like, does anyone watch American Dad? Like, I used to many years ago, and they had the alien dude. And, like, the whole reason he's here, this is, is this episode where it's like, I am the decider. But it's like, the whole reason he's even on Earth is because he was a crash test dummy. For, like, a new UFO they were making. And they just left him a note saying he was important, so he didn't feel bad. Okay, sleep up, took your time, I sleep and watch. Hey, no problem, guess. You have a good night. Get some rest. Uh, right. Sorry, we we, we are playing a game, right? 
Sorry, I shall continue. Uh, here we are, my boy. The Crimson Mylands. An area teeming with poison world and Pokemon. Uh, and plenty of other beasties. I heard about your missing, Trundle. If you're looking for the that ruins, they're off that way. Yes, please point it out for me. For now, I'll keep searching for those space-time distortions. There's a little way of knowing when or where one might appear, but I'll do my best. I'm sure it would hardly be handy if my map could tell, tell me... Words. Space on distortions of dangerous places where Pokemon appear. However, if you're brave enough to enter them, you might be able to find rare Pokemon. Oh, okay. We're going to have a look at them. Uh, not necessary to partnerization is quite effective, especially what happened with the Manhattan Project. You had Mary Cups who don't even know what each other did. Not saying it's true or not true. I they tend to keep someone. Oh, yeah, no, there's definitely stuff to keep off the radar. Like, like, there's definitely stuff that's, like, absolutely classified. Um, I had projects last five years, not five decades. But, um, you yeah, know, I believe that. Five decades is a long time. Especially considering, uh, making nuclear stuff. Now, if you look through my inquiries, you may find some intrigue of your, if you're one particular person of interest to do with the inquiries I have laid upon the stars, then you shall definitely find something with your curiosity. And I good day to you, dear. And Q13. Uh, the key is to keep some secrets, but there's a limit how long. So, fast top secret projects, long. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, like, wait. That's how half of these big projects get outed. You tend to have some whistleblower that comes forward. It's always fun watching them. But hey. But yeah, I, I don't believe the government has aliens. It's just too... Too convenient. Yeah, too convenient of a lie. Uh, counting on you to carry out your survey, best you can. Be mindful of your limitations as well, won't you? If all Pokemon are giving you trouble, I suggest you go to training grounds and have Captain Zizu teach you Pokemon. Uh, teach your Pokemon some strong moves. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, if they're aliens, it would be the other way around. The government wouldn't have aliens. The aliens have the government. Yeah. But then again, like, that, is, that in itself is also an assumption. Because they may be able to get here, but who says they're not, like, on a similar level of technology? They just got a bit of luck in making something to get across the universe. Well, how do we know they weren't, like, right at our front door? Oh, hello. Like, there's a lot of factors to think about. And it ran away. God damn it. Sweet. I think the government, most of them, are too stupid to keep secret, let alone anything with uh, true value up to why they're pay for currency or cheap metal for coin or hmm no I, th I think for the most part governments are pretty good at keeping secrets, like if they don't want something out, they can hide it 
And it comes back to that whole thing of, uh, you know, if something stays hidden long enough, eventually someone may come out with it. Also, I want that. Oh no, Yangi. I think we have stupid people in government, but I don't think overall governments are that stupid. Like, they know what they're doing. I mean, you could argue they don't. Oh shit, that's just starting. When did that happen? Also, I want that. We'll uh, catch up with that after the ad break. Shit. Um. Yes. I do. I do have a new uh, ads redeem, which is broken. Why is everything broken at the moment? I'm hoping it's just the need for, uh... Okay, what have I got? Let's, uh... Let's bring out old, uh, Yowie hands here. I like to think Wizen's not gonna affect him. Or it does. Okay, what have we got? Uh, we'll use an iron. Okay, I think we're out of here. Um, that's not good. Okay, we'll just keep moving. No one seen nothing. I do apologize, everyone. I, d I didn't see the wee pop up for the ads. Yes, in uh, yeah, um, I'll just catch up on chat in a second. Get rid of him. Nice. Uh, even Alpha Centauri, then it'll start with Take Rough the Unreased. Get to, and an important note would be incapable of slowing down on the other side with him through. Yeah. Yeah, it would, um. <sighs> like, you could slow down, but you'd definitely have a very long trip. And you'd need, like, better tech than what we have. 
So yeah, it'd probably take about a thousand years. Also, hello, Despair Doctor. Um, I remember when there was a tiny nebula visible in the sky, and it made me feel like one of those planets might have looked up and saw ours. Sure, we're looking at them from a billion years ago. Billions of years apart, but I wonder if they felt the same all looking up. Then as if there was ever intelligent light. Look, yeah, I think that's... I think that's probably the best way to look at it. It's like the likelihood of life being out there at the same time of us, given like thousands of years. Millions of years, billions of years. It's honestly probably incredibly unlikely. I like to think there's something out there. The universe is too big not to be. Uh, also, we're pretty underpowered, so I need to do something. Uh, there are people who personally believe aliens do control the government. I'm just very cautious. Yes, same here. Things like wanting communication to enslave us or friend friendship may as well be very just human protections on creatures we have no concept or desire. Yeah. Like, we, we don't know. Really what their intentions are we don't know if they're, if they're how they think is similar to us or it's different like if they're more advanced than us you know their whole way of thinking will be totally different like they may look down at us as like barbarians or even worse ants we might just be ants to them I return. Welcome back, man. Uh, everything is broken because nothing has been fixed. And to human is to error. Therefore, human is to be. But humans don't always do things with logic. No. We're very illogical creatures. Uh, rest Pokemon. Yeah, I'll go till morning. Yeah, the whole idea of life out there does interest me. It's just such a big, vast universe. We don't really know. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm a firm believer that there are things just blatantly beyond human comprehension. Like, yeah, we might be the cleverest thing on this planet. To be fair, on a universal scale, we're probably incredibly fucking stupid. Uh, also, request time. Uh, I'd love to know more about Pokemon called Rosalia. It has these gorgeous red and blue flowers for hands. It's such a graceful Pokemon. I come to the Golden Low uh, Lowlands to admire the Rosalia. But just watching them from afar isn't enough for me anymore. Do you think you could complete Rosalia's page in the Pokédex of yours and show it to me? I believe so. So it had red and blue flowers. But yeah, I was going to say two things. One, with basically anything on the internet, we can choose to believe or trust, or not. But anyways, we actually have a family friend who is here to secure one, but they don't talk much about it. Effectively, every single thing worked on during this stint is now public knowledge. It's not as super fast or insane as people think. Nah. Like I. Funny, uh, the funniest conspiracy theories I've heard is that someone didn't believe in their space station existed at all. You look up and see it with their eyes. Yeah, it's only like it's only like a few thousand kilometers up, isn't it? Give me a sec. I need to. Uh, do a citation on that. Yeah, it's only about 408 kilometers in high in orbit. Or 250 miles. So it's really not that far up. Oh, 
Well, yeah, I don't know. Something will happen one day. And it'll be super fun to watch. Maybe we'll finally get them aliens. Oh, you little shit, come here. Also, we can evolve the Eevee too. So we'll have to keep an eye on... So I have to ask uh, Dylos if she would like to evolve the Eevee. Well, that's also another thing. Uh, if anyone who's named Pokemon, I will be asking if you would like to evolve it or not. Yeah. Other than that. Kinda of don't have much else to say on aliens at the moment. Okay, this is Psyduck, don't wanna deal with them. Thanks, Jelly. Not a fan of the alien talk. Ooh, what's this? I must investigate. Dodging is everything. Everything. When a wild Pokemon is lashing out at you with its moves, you dodge right out of the way. While you're dodging their moves, a whiz right not hit you. Uh, the craziest one of hers, Beef Swordly's Canada does, doesn't exist. I mean, how do we know? Have you personally seen a Canadian? I haven't. Oh, shit's about to go down. Now, for reference to how insanely close the ISS really is, you mentioned it orbits 402 kilometers away. Earth's exosphere, though, in my slab atmosphere, is. Yeah. Yeah, it's really close. Like, scarily close. Like, even the distance to the moon is. How do I put it? Ridiculously under exaggerated if you read in a textbook or like how they visualize it. <clears throat> so, anyway, who's this? I am Kalaba the, of the Pearl Clan. Warden Kalaba to you. Oh, now would you look at that? You have a so this is dear kaflut. That's a word. You must be the one they say fell out of the space-time rift. Yeah, I guess. I like that. Why the vague response, hmm? Something died. I've already heard about you. You quelled that... Uh, that you quelled Cleaver's frenzy. I'm sure many people were saved by your actions, but I wonder if there wasn't some other way to handle the situation. What you did is hardly different from bullying a Pokemon in submission, after all. And you run about catching Pokemon up in those little balls you carry. I don't need any help from your sort. All the time and clan for that matter. That young lady, Irizu, offered to help, but associating with the Diamond Clan just won't do. Be on your way. There is much I there is much I must do, and I'd prefer not to be distracted any further. Damn, what a grump. 
But hey, can't help it. Some people just don't want help. She'll come around eventually. Ah, Grundle. How about you show me that strength that could quell a f even a frenzied lord? Uh, I'm a bit busy right now, my dude. Who knows? Who knows when I'll get the next chance, please? I ask you to face me now. Oh, God damn it. Alrighty. What you got? Togepi. Right, Dylos, you're up. You use a stairs at the target with his baby doll eyes. The slowest target's offensive stairs. Let's do it. Kill it with cuteness. Oh, I see how it is. Uh, we'll go. Tackle. Okay, so what's that do? I'll return to normal and... Okay. Um... I'm gonna need to do some leveling up for my Pokemons. Okay. What's that? Who was that? Pillow Khan, how are you? So sorry, I'm in the middle of trying to not die a horrible death. <laughs> oh, we're not sit down like that. Um, I'm sorry. Yes, I was sure about that. Oh, also, uh, Dylos. Um, you, the Eevee is able to evolve. Would you like to evolve it? Some of the strong stuff. See what happens. Nothing. Oh, this is pissing me off. You should not for over. Okay. The fuck is this bullshit? Okay, do it. Uh. Oh, okay, okay. Shit. Oh, shit. That's bullshit. That is utter bullshit. I don't really have anything else. Um, okay, Sparks it is. What oh, use Thunder Fan? Oh, fuck's sake. being beaten by a fucking Togepi. Fuck me. Uh, just 
Just realize what loot. Yeah, I'm. Fuck. A, f a few Pokemon are a little underleveled. Uh, do a double hit. Strong style. Just gonna use draining kiss. Okay, it didn't go up by much. If I use a quick attack. Oh, that's good, that's good. If I hit him with a strong style tackle. Oh, yes. Okay, sweet. Uh, get a little tank boys uh, from Gen 2 here. Um, I, hit, I know what that is, and I'm screwed. Um, do I have a revive? Uh, bulky cow Pokemon to self here when you just, uh, rolling a sweep type. Oh, that sounds like a pain in the ass. Um, okay, yeah, we hands up. Yes, yellow hands. You asked, I named. Um, I'm gonna have to uh, be on do it. I'm sorry, yellow hands. You are the sacrificial lamb. Hit him, hit him hard. Just do it. Oh, look at that. Come on, do it, survive. Look at that, beautiful. I'd say that's a, uh, Grand success. Oh my, you're quite the adept in structuring Pokemon battle. My goodness, that was fun. It was actually kind of fun. Because most of the Pokemon I've uh, taken on so far are kind of shit. Uh, such pr prodigious strength. Now, let me just heal you up Pokemon. Thank you, asshole. Well now, I think that settles it. I must ask your help in retrieving a, a stolen wall fragment. With your skill, you should... It should be a clint, uh, cinch. Uh, yeah, we'll just do that. Yes, exactly. Some bandits pillaged and... Uh, ah, fucking ruins. Can't say that word. Um, because I'm stupid. Uh, made a fragment or engravings. Have you not heard of the notorious misfortune? There are true bandits that even hit us Ginkgo Guild uh, merchants more than a few times. 
uh, not the kind of regulars I like to have, let me tell you. Mistress Caliber is doing everything she can to re uh, regain the fragment, but at 99 years, damn, she, she is looking pretty good for 99. Don't tell her I said that. It's a bit hard for her to chase leads all over the place. Uh, leaving all the responsibility to the kid. I know, right? The kid shall save us. Uh, so what do you say, kind sir? Why not help find the fragment for the warden? Oh, naturally, I'll be happy to lend a hand. Those sisters swipe my wares too. And I'm no go girl merchant if I... Take that lying down. And far be it from me to let them just get away with vandalizing the, preci uh, the preci precious ruins in this region. You know, I did see the remains of a campfire near Myland's camp. Perhaps worth checking out. Uh, by the way, if possible, if I to see Emu evolve into a fairy type, uh, we can see. I don't know if Evie will evolve, if it's random or if it's, but yes, we can give it a go, see what happens, final chance. Thank you, Dilos. But yeah. Let's see what we get. I don't know what an EV evolves into. That looks very tight. Uh, Selvion? Oh, that could also be because we, um, I did give it a fairy move. The baby doll eyes, I, I taught it that, so maybe that had an influence on it? Um... We'll replace that. Yeah, put Calm Mind in there as well. Let's see how that works. Uh, you, the child will save the world and capture the most powerful Pokemon. Exactly. Like, like who, who, who would do it themselves? Who, what? Like, what reasonable adult? would actually go into danger themselves. Send the kid. Uh, it's based on friendship, I think it's so probably based on just using it. Okay. Because I'm not too sure how any of this works. All I know is we need to do some leveling up. So uh, what we might do So we'll head back to one of the other areas and we'll just we'll just go fight everything and learn some cool moves. Uh, it's based on friendship and just having fear remove, okay. So I take it. So do all Pokemon have like multiple variants like that, or is it only a handful? So if that's the case, we can possibly manipulate that. Now it's been a campfire, someone must have been here. Now who might you be? 
Not some stray traveller from the look of you. There's only one one reason people go poking around out here in the middle of nowhere. You're up to us three, aren't you? Oh, these must be the three that uh, we had to deal with. Sisters, should we introduce ourselves properly? Before we show this poor fool how wrong he was to assume he could ever beat us. Am I going to have to fight th like three Pokemon? Uh, I bring good luck to my sister wherever I go. And I'll luck to anyone who crosses our paths? I'm the eldest, and I'll be your unlucky charm. Careless whisper plays in the distance. I thought you spotted a four leaf clover. Well, I'll have soon have you seen double. I'm the middle sister. I'm the one on. And I'm one clover you can't pick. I come back and I see a lot of waifu. Welcome back, Mike. Yeah, there's three of them. Heads, I win, tails, you lose. You've got no chance in this game of fortunes. I'm the youngest coin, but I'm definitely not your good luck piece. Oh, they got the JoJo poses. We screwed. Let's handle the sisters. I'll only hurt him a little. Come on, Toxicroc. Let's douse this fallen poison. Oh, God. I mean, depends on the poison. But hey, this is a good opportunity to test out um, the new evolution. Oh, yes, I screwed. deal with that thing. Um. The only one who's Okay, do it. Kick its ass. Okay, he's dead, Jim. Right, who's next? I'm not fond of this outcome, but at least it's still better than plowing fields for the galaxy team. Okay, you got a few, uh... The galaxy team continues to spoil things for me, even after I've left. Take the blasted fragment and go. Just leave us alone. Yeah, more fragment. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, screw it. We'll just skip it. Look, we're just doing stuff, okay? I've got shit to do. I want to go level up my Pokemans.
Oh, but it was the camp here. Yes. Do I have anything I can quickly make up? Not really. Okay. Okay. I, seeing as everything's broken, I might end it here for today. Make it a wee bit of a shorter one. So yeah, hope. So I'll, I'll end it a wee bit shorter today. I'll do some leveling up here. Um... What I ask, so Wednesday, or Tuesday, depending, with Valentine's stream, we will play a, play a Dream Daddy, if anyone who's interested. Uh, pretty much Eevee has a lot of different things it can evolve to, but there are a few Pokemon that have branching interests. Oh, okay, okay. So it's not every, it's not all of them, but it's some of them do. But, yeah, hopefully I can fix all this stuff, and hopefully not... Hopefully, hopefully I can get it all working for um that stream because I have a few new redeems to put up. Oh, have we nose around? See who is online, who we can go and annoy. Uh, thanks for streaming, no problem. Come, thanks for coming along. Uh, to Rose for the raid again, thank you. And to Spear Doctor, thank you for the follow. It'd be a special, hell yeah. Also, thank you to you, Dylos, as well. There's lots to do on Dream Daddy, I know. If, if it's anything like a tough shoujo, we're going to be at this for a while. But yeah, I don't, I don't know if... I if Maybe a stream special? Maybe, maybe just a Valentine special, but, you know. Depending on how things go, we'll play more. Let me see, let me just pop on some fancy snazzy beats. That's what they all say. Oh. Yeah, I said that about Dark Souls as well. It's like a birthday special, but I enjoyed the game so much. I'm still playing it. So yeah, um, basically that's the current rotation. Pokemon and Dark Souls. What a combo. But anyway. Who is online we can go on annoy? Actually, this is somewhere we can go on annoy. I haven't had a chance, but I know they're a friend of Luna. So we're going to go over there and be a pain in the ass. Yeah, here's the raid message for anyone who would like it. Uh, any socials, so ma mainly the Twitter. Like, like you know, if you want to keep up with stuff, Twitter and Discord. Not that I use them much, but yeah, if you're interested. YouTube, I just put all the old VODs on, so... Yeah, you know, watch the same. Do as you please. But we're gonna raid out to her, Jacinda Jace. She's a friend of Luna's, so haven't had much of a chance. They're playing Lethal Company at the moment, so we head over and say hello. But yeah, thank you, everyone, for coming. It's always appreciated. I hope you're enjoying the Pokemon. I don't know much about it. Hopefully I can get everything fixed up. But without further ado, that's me signing off. And I'll uh, catch you on around about Tuesday, Wednesday. So, see you then.